Hello guys, this is Nina Hack, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make an invisible folder. Um, first thing you want to do is make a new folder, or use an existing one. And um, I have these directions right here, which you can, which I will put in the YouTube um, description box. Alright, first things first, right click wherever you want to put the invisible folder to be and select create new folder. It could be an existing one too. Uh, right click on the folder and hit rename. Erase the name of the folder so there's nothing there. But now, if you try to stop here, Windows or Vista will tell you that you need to provide a name. So to get around this with the name field still active, hold down ALT and press 060 or 255. Um, 255 I think is for Vista. And this is on the number pad and you gotta make sure number lock is on. So let's turn number lock on. And if you're still active, hold on. Alt and 06. One six. Okay. Let's go to rename. Alt. Oh. One six. Alright, so now we have an invisible folder, or um, invisible name actually, but there is still a folder there. So what we're going to do is, okay, let's, uh, let's close this. Okay, so here we have our invisible folder. Now, step two is making the folder actually invisible. Alright. Now, we want to click on the nameless folder and right click it and select properties. Uh, you want to make sure read only selected. And then in the general tab, and then you want to go to customize. And you want to go to change icon. And um, just browse through until you find one invisible. As you see uh, right here, I have um, a couple. I click OK. And OK again. Just wait for that to load up. And there you go, you have an invisible folder. Do note though, um, it is invisible, but it's still you're still able to um, click it. So if you're gonna um, hide it, you might want to either change it, uh, the desktop, and it change it so it's not a desktop item, and put it in a folder and hide it somewhere very good, or put it um, somewhere in the middle of your desktop. Because if you go over it with your mouse, you won't really see it unless you're on it for a while, and they could just think that's just random. So yeah, um, this works for both Vista and Windows, um, but Vista, I believe, is 255. I don't have Vista, but just try, try 0160, but if it doesn't work, then try 255. And make sure it is on the number pad, which is to the right of the keyboard most of the time. And uh, so yeah, that's how you make an invisible icon.